It has been one year since 29 year old Patrick Gooch died in a car crash. He was driving on Interstate 840 when his truck went off the road and hit a bridge pillar, according to state troopers. In the 365 days since his passing, his family has learned more about Patrick than they knew. His sister shared how their world and memories of him have changed. He had called his wife Jessica a few minutes prior to the accident and he had made a statement to her that he didn't feel great, he didn't feel good, and that he was going to get off on the next exit and maybe get something to eat, get something to drink, um, but he never made it off the exit. When a loved one passes, you may assume you'll be left with only the memories you have of them. It's rare that you learn more about who they are once they're gone. But that's exactly what happened to Patrick Gooch's older sister, Brittany Gooch Moose. We didn't know what kind of an impact Patrick had on other people returning from military lifestyle, making the transition into um, civilian lifestyle, college lifestyle. We didn't know. Patrick was a Marine veteran who served overseas in Afghanistan and here at home. His service continued in Chapel Hill with the Carolina Veterans Organization, helping fellow veteran college students transition into civilian life. Complete strangers called, emailed, came to the funeral. Um, we, we didn't know. And it was so amazing to see those stories as hard as they were to, to hear. Patrick's legacy is evident in the lives he changed, the love he had for his family, in his perfect match, his wife, Jessica, and in the son he never met. When the accident happened, Jessica, his wife, was expecting their baby. And Patrick was so excited to be a dad. Theodore Patrick was born in August of last year, um, healthy, happy, and looks just like Patrick. Brittany remembers how much Patrick wanted to be a dad, how close they were, and how he cared for others. But she wants you to remember something about her brother, too. But I hope people remember his heart. He, he just had a caring, giving heart. This is obviously a hard story for Brittany to tell, but she wants people to know about Patrick because he is still helping others even after his death. The Carolina Veterans Organization that Patrick was such an integral part of launched the Sergeant Patrick Googe Memorial Scholarship, and they're hoping to raise $100,000 to help other student veterans at UNC Chapel Hill. I'll have all that information for you on our website.